Uh, something burning. Maybe, uh, cannabis. Are you mad? I waited outside the uh, medical center for uh, eons. Where were you? Helping Vanessa with her Spanish. I'll strike a time. Uh, Sorry. Closet. I told him Wellesley was a women's college. That's Caroline's sweatshirt. That too. I told him that too. I told him it was mom's sweatshirt. <clears throat> Take it off, please. Did, did it ever occur to you that I might I might be saving that sweatshirt? Hmm? Please don't rip it. Wellesley is a women's college. God, what a number. We didn't just donate her clothes on a whim. We did it for your psychological well-being. Will you wait in the car? Let's see. Uh, Professor Weatherhole is a conceited dickhead. An asshole. Unfair. Oh, here's one. What does it say? Professor Weatherhold is knowledgeable, but he doesn't impart that knowledge to his students. He barked information at us all semester, and then he complained when our papers did not measure up to his, his our standards. I'll, I'll dig deeper. Hey, can we go to the mall tonight instead of this afternoon? There's like three games I want to watch. I can't go to the mall tonight. Why's that? I'm busy. Yeah, I'm busy with what? I you gotta go to the mall. I have an appointment. Really? Yes. With who? You're with none of your business. An appointment with whom? None of your business. I just want to know. God. Dr. Hardigan. I knew it. Good work. You spend fifty. You spend fifty dollars on dinner. That's grounds for intercourse with none of your business. Dad, if there are any romantic inklings, you're simply not ready. I mean, the sociosexual mores have really shifted. Uh, and let, let's not forget the stigma attached to widowers. Widowers. At some point, the statute of limitations has got to run out on that. We're not talking about this anymore. 